Is the clock ringing alone? The 2017 study on Singapore's older family caregivers by CARE showed that caregivers above 70 years old are primarily spouses, 90% of whom are female. More than half of these older family caregivers do the work alone. Many of them are in declining health themselves, with 30% showing symptoms of clinical depression. Despite their frailties, they, can, they dedicate up to 60 hours a week in caregiving. In another MSF survey on informal caregiving, it was shown that caregivers experience substantial stress due to financial problems arising from caregiving. This was especially acute with younger caregivers because of their multiple commitments. These so-called sandwiched caregivers have to work, tend to their children and care for their elderly parents. If we as aspire to be a caring society, then we cannot be negligent towards caregiver. The elderly folks taking care of their spouses, caregivers for the disabled, or the above mentioned sandwich caregivers, they deserve our support and utmost respect. To, to help them, one way is to provide tax rebates for families with members who are caregivers. Another would be di through direct allowances with CPF contributions provided to caregivers to defray the loss of incomes due to caregiving and ensure long-term security. In Australia, allowances are given to those with heavy and regular caring duties that result in foregone earnings. In Norway, municipalities which are responsible for long-term care services employ family caregivers directly and provide a wage and insurance plan. We could also introduce a long-term care insurance plan and LTC insurance, which individuals can tap on to pay for their own LTC arrangements, as well as those of their family members. This will be similar to France and Germany, where social security or LTC insurance can be used for oneself or one's family members. With our growing population, the burden on caregivers will increase significantly. To be a truly compassionate society, we need to put in place structures of, stru of support for the caregivers in our midst. Thank you.